All right, so this is our um, Ada fruit our, with our Adarino inside. So we're gonna open it by opening the side of the box this way. Nice little Ada fruit label right here. And then you've got the bubble wrap. Try to resist the urge to pop it until we've done it. This is the actual Arduino that we are trying to get, so that's really important. So put that to the side. Um, this right here, this kit right here. Uh, we're gonna open this up and we're gonna get this out and we're gonna get this piece out. And we're gonna try to put this on here and then we're gonna try to attach this on here also. So let's come back to that. All right, so this is the kit that you need right here and you're gonna be working on page two. So this is page two right here. And you have to look very carefully where the minus sign is right there on the picture because a couple students, they took the sticker off and they stuck it on the wrong way. I wanna to try to do it exactly the way that it is right here. Okay, so I'm gonna open this up and show you what I'm talking about. This kit right here is where the nuts and bolts and screws are. You have to kind of look in there. The bolts and the screws are in there and I'll get those out and show you. They're in this bag right here. This other stuff you just kind of put to the side. So, pause it. Sign on that board. So you're looking for that minus sign to line it up with where the power thing goes right here. So what you do is you turn this board into the same orientation that you're gonna do this in, like, like that, and then you put everything on it in the same orientation using your Adarino. So that's what we're gonna do. Some students have already messed up on that, so let's pay attention. So right here, I'm trying to get the little bolts out. That's a nut right there. And there's a couple little nuts and bolts that we're trying to get out without losing all the little pieces. So there's a bolt and there's a nut. These are the pieces you need to get out. Right now, there's another one. And are there any more that we can find? There's gotta be one more. Here's another one. All right, put this stuff to the side. We don't need that right now. All right. Now, you see this? Now let's open this up. There's a little nick in the side where you can open it up. So we open that up. And again, the little minus sign is right here. And we're gonna glue that down right there by taking the little sticker off. So I'm taking the sticker off. And I'm gonna glue down the minus side right here very carefully. Try to line it up and glue it down the way that it's supposed to go like that, okay? So right here is the Arduino, right here in the case. Somebody's gonna get this one because I'm helping you out. You guys can be the first ones to upload the uh, software onto it. So I'm taking the Arduino out, and it's a little bit tricky to get out of this case. Save these feet. These feet go on the bottom of this uh, little package here. So this guy goes right here, like that. And there's just one little problem, is that the screws, or the bolts, don't like to hold it down in place very well. So I'm gonna see if I can come up with a way to get it to work a little bit better. So let's see if this bolt can go through right there. So I'm gonna put him right there instead. The directions say to do it here and here, but we're having a little problem doing that. So we're gonna do it here instead, right there. And you screw in the nut right here. need your little fingers to do it. You don't really need a screwdriver or anything. And then we're gonna do the opposite side right here. Okay? So do the opposite side right there. And you screw this down like this. Nice. These are small little bolts. All right, you got this one. Screwing it in right here. 
All right, and then you fit it over the circuit board like this, right there. And then you're gonna screw those other bolts in like this to hold it onto the board. Okay. This part you gotta go a little bit slower. And I need one more bolt. So before I put that last bolt on, I'm gonna put these little feet on. These little feet go right here. One, two, this makes it so it doesn't slide around on the table. Three, four, and then I need one more bolt that I need to find from this package over here. That I guess I did not dump out yet. Here it is. And you put the last bolt in the last spot and you've built, yeah, you've built your circuit board. So the next step will be to upload the software so you can start programming this little guy. And the way that you upload the software is I will show you in this booklet. So you've built your little circuit board. It's ready to go. Basically, you have a little computer ready to go. The minus sign is lined up right here with that little button, and you're ready to go. Are we good to go? Pause. So here is the website that you go to. You type this in the URL, not in the search bar. That goes in the URL above the search bar. And then you go here and you do this. I think we've already installed this for you already. So that's what I'm trying to do with Miss Burkholm has already installed that for you. So hopefully we can skip this step. The next thing you need is this USB cord. This is your power source and also how you program the computer. And it plugs in right here. And from what I've been told, usually it goes like this, but in this case, it actually goes upside down to plug into the power source. Once you plug this in, then you plug in the USB and you're ready to program your Arduino with the first uh, kit.